hello viewers i welcome you all from agility of tech channel uh, in these videos we are going to see uh, the images working with images in last video we saw how we can add the logo uh, or indication to that type of logos and then we saw how we can upload the images here <coughs> and now we will see how we can add an image uh, in a form uh, as a web resource okay so for adding uh, image as a web resource it's quite easy uh, you have to go into customize the system in customize the system if i go into entities and in if i go into the that particular entity on which we are going to add that is the contact entity in contact entity if i go into forms uh, these are different types of forms and uh, this is a contact form right now here you can see that it is a uh, form and uh, in this form if i go uh, if i go and uh, show show you about uh, sales and contacts here you if i go into that form here you can see that this is the form okay this is the same uh, form that we are talking about now here uh, i'm going to add uh, one thing as a uh, web resource so here i am going into insert uh, web resource here i uh, i'm going to add a web resource okay so for adding a web resource i will uh, first of all add a new web resource uh, i will name it as contact logo contact pick okay uh, the name will be same the type uh, we are going to add is a png image english and now i'm going to select that image which i'm going to add let's suppose we are going to add this image okay so uh, you can add as a png format or jpg format both are uh, image and now i'm going to save it after saving it mm, i'm going to publish it so that uh, my web resource will be available then i'm going to, uh, this is a new contact pic i'm going to add it and uh, it will be web resource underscore contact pic and label will be same image not available in case the uh, alternative text is that i'm going to click on okay okay so this is a, a web resource that I have just created and uh, if I go into the, the formatting uh, it is a one column okay number of rows it may occupy uh, I'm going to uh, keep it eight vertical alignment uh, horizontal alignment and use available lock original image size or you can specify the uh, custom width or height as well after that I'm going to uh, save it and after saving it, I am going to publish it. Now, once it is published, I am going to refresh that page. And once the uh, page is refreshed, here you can see that uh, now the contact image is now available in the form, in the form of web resource. Okay, now if I go and uh, move it to uh, top position that is here and then I am going to save it you can change the position and I am going to publish it so after publishing if I now again refresh the page here you will notice that now the image position is on the top so in this way you can add images to <coughs> your uh, forms in any entity and uh, they may be used as a web resource. I thank you all for watching this video.